The Roux Scholarship launched 35 years ago. Back then, British chefs were not on the culinary map, but brothers Albert and Michel Roux set out to change that. They wanted to give British chefs the chance to shine on a worldwide stage, and thanks to this competition, their dreams became a reality. The name of the young British chef have been established now and it's due to the Roux Scholarship. If you look at all those youngsters over those years who have won, they are all leaders in different spheres of our industry and that's a great accolade. If you're talented, um, you, will, you will shine through. You know, this competition, yes, it is tough, very, very tough, but um, the reward is immense. The Ruse Scholarship is a unique competition for any professional chef working in the UK aged between 22 and 30. The prize for the winner is a three-month stage at any three-star Michelin restaurant in the world, all expenses paid. What's more, the winner will gain the support of the whole Rue family throughout the rest of their career. The best thing about Rue and the Rue Scholar is just the support and the network that it gives you in this competition and being part of that family. For me, I was, there's only one place I wanted to go and I've, it had to be Japan. There's a restaurant called Ryugan in Tokyo and just going there was an absolute eye-opener and to go out of my comfort zone into something that I've never really seen before and into the unknown. And without the Rue Scholarship and the support of the family, I would have never been able to go through those experiences. Being a Rue Scholar just definitely means something. It does carry a lot of weight having that kind of title. This year, Michelle and Alain have invited three women to sit on the judging panel. Angela, Rachel and Claire, all fantastic chefs. Um, and uh, I, I think it's just going to keep the boys on their toes. Indeed, three ladies, three great chefs. When um, I was asked to be part of the judging panel, I felt really honoured. And I think it's an incredible institution and uh, something that I think a lot of young chefs should get involved with. And for me, the Rue Scholarship ultimately symbolises uh, classical cooking, knowledge, skills that are so important to the industry. Hopefully, uh, myself being on the judging panel will inspire other female chefs to enter the Rue Scholarship and there can be a, a few more women in the competition. I was very touched when I was asked to be a member of the judging panel uh, a few years back and then obviously, and, and it evolves every year and I think it's great that new people come on because you always have a different perspective and I think that's very important when you judge and then it's just, you know, a table of some great chefs around the country that all come together to judge a wonderful competition. What can you say about them? They're just, they're just brilliant in their field. So it's, uh, it's a pleasure to have them on board. They're formidable, they're a force and I think they're going to bring an eye of detail for the level they cook at every day and I think that's going to only add weight to the competition. An incredible opportunity. You've got to be in it to win it, it's as simple as that. And you don't have to come from Michelin star background. No, a kitchen is a kitchen, a competition is a competition. You need to be good on the day as well. If I can win it, anyone can win it. I went into the competition with no experience, um, never worked in a Michelin starred restaurant. If you don't enter, you won't win. I think the only thing that's stopping you is you, is anyone can win it. Go for it. As in the previous two years, the Roos have invited another three Michelin star chef to take on the role of honorary president of judges. Following on from Pierre Gagnier in 2016 and Anne-Sophie Pique in 2017, the legendary Michel Gerard will be bringing his wealth of knowledge to the panel of judges. You know, there's no question about it. He's, he's a dear friend of the family, but he's such a respected chef in the world. And no wonder he's been chosen twice from our scholars. Alors, je connais la famille Roux depuis le début des années 1970. Alors, quand j'ai reçu l'appel de Michel Roux pour participer à ce concours, j'ai spontanément répondu oui. D'abord, c'est l'amitié qui parle. Et puis ensuite, il y a aussi la qualité et l'importance du concours. Promouvoir ce beau travail manuel dans lequel les hommes peuvent s'épanouir, c'est formidable. Quand on m'a demandé d'accueillir Andrew et Mathieu, euh, les yeux fermés, je les ai accueillis, sans, sans difficulté bien sûr, et avec enthousiasme, parce que j'ai une confiance absolue euh, dans la qualité professionnelle des frérots. Quand j'ai eu la choix d'un restaurant Michelin 3-star en France, 
There was two or three that I had considered, but Michel Guerin, for me, as a, even as a young apprentice, was always a kind of godlike figure. Je me souviens en particulier d'Andrew quand il est arrivé. Nous travaillions très dur à l'époque, et donc il, il est rentré dans la brigade. Et il a eu la chance d'être pris un peu sous l'aile de ma femme, qui l'a vite considéré comme un fils. It kind of almost brings the scholarship full circle for me, anyway. Michel Gerard is extraordinary. I, I still remember uh, my first meal there about 35 years ago. I can still taste it. He is a genius, so we're, we're overjoyed that he agreed to come and be our honorary judge this year. It's all about family, it's all about legacy, seeing great things and giving a young chef the opportunity to do anything they can dream about doing. To be a great chef, you need to know classical cuisine, so you could not enter a better competition. And to be part of that family, it's a no-brainer to me. If you're to become a Rue Scholar, there's no doubt that it, it's a cliche, but it will change your life.